Hey, it's you. Still waiting, I see. Any news? No, but they promised, right? They'll get here soon. I'm sure they will. I'll drop by later to check in on you, if that's okay. Okay. Yeah, they're never coming. They're just not coming. I don't know if I get to be there when that happens, though. All right, here's Tactus. I don't remember Tactus. I recognize you. You're Commander Shepard. And you must be Tactus. Heard the refugees consider you their leader. Yes, someone needs to sort out this mess. CSEC has tightened access to the Citadel, and we've got desperate people down here with no place to go. I also hear you need basic medical supplies. Dr. Chalkwist spoke of a mutually beneficial trade. Ah, right. I tried to be clear. In my experience, the Alliance looks out for their own. Trust is a hard thing to come by these days. I know you need our military supplies, but they're worth far more than your basic meds. Her offer wasn't satisfactory. Uh, no, I can paragon my way out of this. Do the right thing. Your people need our supplies, and my people need every edge we can get. Your combat-grade meds will make a difference. And our mission may just save everyone. Now's not the time for pettiness or mistrust. With our day-to-day -day worries, it's easy to forget we are all in this together. I'll have my people contact yours. You'll have your supplies as soon as possible. All right. Five more Paragon points my way. We got another quest done. I do need to talk to Dr. Chalkwist in order to finalize it, it appears. But we got it done. Doesn't look like anybody else around here wants to talk. And this is empty because I killed Kelly. Hooray! I liked Kelly, damn it. But no, I can't make all the right decisions when I'm just deciding on the fly. Once in a while, I have to do a bad one. It's not on purpose, I guarantee it. All right. Well, every once in a while, I'll do one on purpose, but no. You'll know. That wasn't one of them. Sane? Hey, I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with our My personality matrix can predict what the real Commander Shepard would say with 7% accuracy. Yeah. Once again, 7% accuracy. Already talked about that before. She's only 7% accurate, not, you know, 93% accurate. So, we got uh, quite a few things going on around here. Like I said, it feels like it's starting to be the end of the game. But we haven't even met up with Corians. I assume we'll be seeing Tally while we're there. Honestly, at this point, if we don't meet Tally, if Tally's not in this game, I'm going to be very upset, but I'm pretty sure she will be. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. Hey, it's Javik! How you doing, Javik? Hell of a view, isn't it? During our war, this place became a myth to my people. A dream glimpsed only in the memory shards. The citadel was both the heart of our civilization and its demise. The Reapers hid here first, didn't they? No one I knew had ever seen the citadel. To be here now, I don't know what to think. It's a victory. It might not seem like much, but a Prothean is standing on the citadel alive. That's a victory in itself. Perhaps. When things were at their darkest, we used to tell stories, imagining the wonders of this place. The seat of our empire, the power to sway worlds. The galaxy belonged to us. Nowadays, a lot of races have embassies here. It's true, then. You share power with the rest? It's not perfect, but it's kept the peace. Most of the time. Pardon me. This one has been listening. This one suspects you are a Prothean. Hey, Hannah. I remember your kind when you were still minnows in the ocean. This one is unworthy. This one has seen the face of an Enkindler. 
They consider your kind to be their gods. A pity we did not teach them to speak better. You're really a Prothean? I am. But... If you lost the last war, what hope do we have? For many, there may be no hope. The Reapers killed trillions in my cycle. The odds of being among the... Uh, I don't think that's gonna work. But you are still alive now. That alone is a miracle. And you still have the power to fight. My people knew your kind when you were young. Torian, Asari, Hana. There was potential in all of you. Now you must seize that potential and become the weapon you are meant to be. The weapon that tells the Reapers we are not machines. We are alive and we will fight back. Thank you. That meant a lot. Commander Shepard, it must be an honor to have a Prothean fighting alongside you. Uh, it is. I don't use him too often because he's DLC, but it's great. He's a good guy or he's kind of scary. He's both, but he's mostly a good guy. He's starting to learn his way around. Javik is one of the best soldiers I've ever seen. The commander is a capable warrior as well. For a human who once lived in caves. Thank you, commander. I've enjoyed my time here. Walking among the young. I will see you back on the Normandy. All right. Well, yep, we got some reputation. I don't get any Paragon for that? Or war assets or, like, anything? Just a bit of reputation for the quick time event, I guess. We did your thing already. But, yeah, I was expecting a lot more out of that. Hey, Samara's here now. I hoped you'd come. I won't remain here much longer. What are you doing on the Citadel, Samara? I suppose I came to say goodbye. Faler is safe, and Rila is at rest. I felt the need to speak to you before heading to battle. I want you to know there is no one else I'd rather see leading us in our last hours. It's an honor. We'll make the galaxy proud. The largest fleet in history is already on our side. It is impressive. Most would have deemed such an alliance impossible. But Shepard, be sure to assess your force's strengths and weaknesses before setting out. All right, let's talk to her a bit. We don't get too many options uh, or too many chances to talk to Samara, so let's take care of as many as we can. So are the Justicars all in the war? What are the other Justicars doing for the war? Most have made it home. They will attempt to hold Thessia. With the odds we face, it's possible our order will no longer exist after this war. There's that few of you? Our numbers were never great. We must prepare to sacrifice ourselves, if that is what's required. So you guys are Jedi. Was being a Justicar worth it if that's how it all ends? The Justicars were formed to bring order to a world that laughs at the notion. The role is solitary. Its demands are lonely and uncompromising, often to the point of pain. But following the code left me with no regrets. Take that for what you will. All right. Tell me about the Reapers. What do you think of them? You know, I never asked you if your code has anything useful on fighting Reapers. Treat them as any other enemy. Show no quarter, mercy, or weakness. The only difference is the scale of our foe. The code is too strict to account for such small discrepancies. What about you? Is that how you see it too? You yourself killed a Reaper on the Citadel, and then another on Tachanka. I can only follow such bravery. Two for two. Uh, well, except for the ones on Earth and everywhere. Two for 150,000. Uh, tell me about Falaire. Will Falaire be all right in the monastery? Or what's left of it? We spoke for some time. It won't be easy. But if there is a way to survive, Falaire will find it. It was... Good to see her again. 
Perhaps it's unseemly for a Jessica to dwell so much on her family. I'm glad you still have one, though. I'm just happy things worked out. I was fortunate that Falaire saw things so clearly. And it would have turned out quite differently without your intervention. Thank you. Anything else? That looks like it's it. Good luck out there, Samara. You as well. I don't know if you believe in such things. But goddess, go with you, Shepard. Well, I go with we'll myself. We'll both be tested in fire soon enough. And I am a goddess, so there's that. Well, let's say, I better get some kind of points for that. Two paragon points for that. I feel like I should be close to max there. Uh, somebody talk around here? Don't you guys talk? You could send the girl to your side of the family. Are you kidding? My family disowned me when I married Neota. Want to guess why? Uh, sorry. Why? They'd be happier to see those Cerberus assholes than they would be to see me. I understand why you would not wish to send your daughter to them. Yeah. Your understanding doesn't help me or my daughter much right now. Super! Lots of difficult situations just everywhere. Uh, C-Sec, see if Commander Bailey has anything new to talk about. He might. Like, a whole bunch has changed. Hey, Shepard. I have to admit, the place feels safer with you here. Everyone's walking around in a daze. Or in my case, limping. And I wonder if we'll ever be the same. These are dark days for all of us. Well, that's it. You got your work cut out for you. You and me both, Shepard. Yeah, this place has changed after the second major attack on the Citadel. <laughs> any, any bets on if there's going to be a third? I don't think there's time for a third, but seriously, the Citadel is, like, not secure. Never has been, it feels like. Alright, see here it makes sense that they recognize my status as a Spectre. So, message terminal over here. That's new. Good to see you're all right, Shepard. Miranda, what's going on? Couldn't meet in person. The Citadel is too dangerous right now. I heard about the attempted coup. Yeah, with Kai Lang's help, Udina nearly seized control. Kai Lang? That slippery bastard still alive? He's alive and right in the middle of all this. That complicates things. I'll be on my guard. Look, I don't have much time, but I learned what happened to my sister. Where is she? I don't know that yet, but my father was definitely responsible. If he's done anything to her, I'll kill him. Miranda. Shepard, listen. I'm being hunted by Cerberus assassins, a lot of them. I need to stay out of sight. What? Why? I heard a rumor, maybe more, that my father is working on something for the elusive man. Something big. <laughs> We're back to these camera angles, are we? There's no, there's no reason other than for me to look at her butt. There's no other reason. Miranda just controls the camera with her mind, I think. So there's ties to Cerberus. Why would your father be working with the elusive man, especially now? My father is ruthless about preserving his legacy. Legacy? He has an obsession with making his mark in history, ensuring his dynasty lasts forever. And you think the elusive man made him an offer? Exactly. Then we'll stop him. Whatever's going on with your father can't be good. We have to figure this out. I have all the time in the world. I agree, but I need to do this myself. It's time I stopped running from him. You're sure? Yes. I can't think straight until I know Ari is safe. Be careful. I can't promise that, Shepard. Could you? No. I couldn't. All right, do we get a quest or something? No, nothing. Um, let's look at the requisitions, I guess. Yeah, nothing new. Let's take a look at the terminal here. Location for Din Korlak. Volus Ambassador Din Korlak's current, anal current location is unknown. Biometric analysis does not detect him in any public location at this time. His last known position was an office suite near the human embassy. So, Din Korlak has moved. They don't, like, ever put anything over here, do they? 
then shooting range. I don't know why. I don't think that this game requires like a practice facility. I don't know. Three games in, I understand how to point and shoot. You know what I mean? I don't do it very often, but I still understand the basic concept. So no Din Korlak anywhere. Looks like we are done around here. Doesn't look like I actually completed any quests anytime since the uh, the original uh, docks. Looks like after that, it's pretty much been talking, but no quests actually finished. Purgatory is up next. Let's see if we can't find something good here. Now arriving at ward level purgatory. Nobody even wants to talk so far. Come on, it's a club. Will you have the armor keep you safe? I've watched reports on some of the things you're fighting. Well, I won't stop a reaper, but an extra second of shielding can be life or death. So Vortex makes good shield capacitors? The best. They don't skip on plating either. I love it. Sounds like you want to get back out there to try it out. You know, a little. Can't wait to show it off to the team. Maybe I can take point more often now. Solarian on point? Wouldn't recommend it. Do you have a Krogan in your crew? They can be on point. How's everybody doing? Drunk off your asses? Good. Nothing. I'm still kind of disappointed in the lack of uh, finishing a couple conversations here. Military trainer? I recovered some texts from a library in Reaper controlled space. I can have them waiting for you at bay D24 if that would help. Really? Oh, damn. It couldn't hurt. Thank you. All right, there's another Maybe quest done. Well, they saw you remember how to fight again. Biotics. Mostly biotics. You have anything new to say, Arya? It seems the galaxy can't keep us apart. The Blue Suns, Blood Pack, and Eclipse are in my pocket. I'll send them to war when you're ready for them. Is there anything on your mind? Same stuff as always. We'll talk later. I'm sure. She's still not too happy with me. Things didn't go too well for her. Anything more to say before I go? Yes. Make a required reading. Light from the shadows. Path to the Justicar. All of it. I've Matriarch Athea's backing on this. I want every Asari maiden thinking with the mind of a huntress. Matriarch Athea, huh? Yes. Okay, you're just repeating yourself. Try to figure out how to get past you. I'm kind of interested in that. What's going on there? Who's this? Oh, that's a drink. Then Cortez is here. Shepard, you made it. Come have a drink with me. Wow, his eyes were very shiny there. You're looking happy. You had it right. Yesterday can't change. Tomorrow, we might all be dead. Today is what matters. I'm not wasting Why it. Why is everybody suddenly- I thought a club would be to your taste. Suddenly thinking we're gonna die. You don't have to get all hot and bothered to appreciate graceful dancing. There's an energy here. There's light. And purgatory serves the best drinks. Here. To our friendship. To you, Steve. And to you, Shepard. A good friend when I needed one most. Thank you. For everything. Can I convert him? Probably not. <laughs> I bet I could have sex with him if I was a guy, though. Uh, five more reputation for me there. I'll see you back on the Norman. And now he's suddenly a little bit more depressed. Uh, don't want to dance anymore. We've seen dancing enough. Uh, almost ran off the edge. Luckily, the game doesn't let me do that. Sometimes it's lucky, sometimes it's not. Nothing from you guys. Uh, anybody over here? Nope, can't even fit through there. Can't turn to the side to say excuse me or nothing. Okay, hold on. Um, let's talk to you first. You probably don't have anything new to say, though. <laughs> the banner of the right. That should put some steel in their spine. Edie and Joker are on a date. Let's interrupt it. Hey, Commander. I was just about to get us another round. 
So, looks like you two are having fun. Yes. Joker has been smiling and laughing at a significantly higher rate since he and I agreed upon a relationship. I mean, he is happier. Yeah, good for you two. It seemed like you two might make a good match. I was not so certain. When I first presented his body to Jeff, he seemed aloof. Really? What did Joker say? He said I didn't have to conform to some feminine ideal in order to impress him. I then called him on his bullshit, and we then proceeded to talk normally. After your encouragement, his attitude exhibited signs of change. He said he was reluctant, but you convinced him to go for it. Oh yeah, I convinced him to shoot a shot. Uh, I did what I could. I might have helped a little. I see. Thank you for your support, Shepard. This is proving to be an illuminating experience. I bet it is. And that was awkward. Two more reputation points for me. You just introduced me as your personal assistance mech. Yeah, well, it was the only way to get you inside. But you know I am not one. Why deceive others? You don't really want to introduce yourself as an AI with reaper based code. They would lynch you. That would be an inefficient way to render me non functional. Yeah, it probably wouldn't work all that well. 